Hi, Jin fans, and welcome to another weekly special of uh, On the Bump with me, your host, Holden Novak, and our special guest who's always with us, but is who is a little bit under the weather today. We're going to see if we can't make it feel a little bit better. Coach Layton Trauma. Ooh. Coach, how you doing today? Well, I'm doing all right. You know, a lot of pollen in the air, but uh, I mean, we got Jin's baseball this weekend, so, you know, I'm feeling pretty good about things. Yeah, 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 I'm feeling real good about it. Uh, just talk about the last series that we just had versus the Strider Mountaineers. The offense was whew, very, very strong uh, in this weekend series. We had a plethora of home runs by Scotty Dwyer, uh, Big Cole Laverne, Big Vern as we like to call him, and uh, Chris Zapata, our Mohawk catcher. Um, just share your thoughts on those. Yeah, I mean, I mean, quite the personalities that go with those home runs, but. Uh... You know, you've got Zapata, who we've never seen with anything but a mohawk at this school. And then you've got Batman, obviously, Cole Laverne, who gets his first of the year. And then to see Scotty hit one over the right center field wall, it was just really good to see. Really good kid, really good player, really good teammate. And it's just really good to see those things happening. I mean, 44 runs in three games, well, that's pretty impressive no matter who you're playing. So just really excited about that. And uh, looking forward to getting back at it this weekend. Yeah, the pitching had two strong showings as well as uh, Dakota Brown uh, and obviously Caleb Kirk, who I feel like we talk about every week on this show, uh, had more strong outings from those two. Yeah, I mean, Kirk's been, been ahead of hitters all year on the mound. He's been commanding his fastball really well. And then Dakota Brown, uh, pitcher of the week from this week, and it's just a, a real testament to him and his uh, – his ability to come out of the outfield and be able to come in in tight situations and get us out of big jams. Uh, he's a gamer. He has been. He's been here for a while. He knows the system. So it's just really good to see those guys uh, being effective like that. But that's what we expect from them. That's what we expect from all these guys. And uh, it's no surprise to us. Uh, so we're just going to keep that train rolling and um, see where this thing goes. That's right. And uh, upcoming series, actually, uh, tomorrow, we got the Trinity Tigers coming to town. A little weekend series. Yeah, we do. Uh, it should be exciting, man. The past, I know ever since I've been here, uh, and games between us and Trinity have been really close, been really up in the air, been a really great atmosphere. And um, we have respect for them, they have respect for us, and uh, it's two great baseball teams, so can't wait to see what happens. We're just going to come out, leave it all on the field. It's just like any other conference series for us. Uh, we're excited to go and um, couldn't be more ready to play at home. So this has been another week of uh, On the Bump with Holden Novak and Coach Leighton Tromba. Oh, and before we forget, uh, this, this live broadcast of this episode is coming to you live from Schimpf Short Porch out at Sheehy Stadium, where uh, he was the first one to hit it into our little, I guess, playpen out here. So he got to name it, and it's Schimpf Short Porch. So join us again next week as we talk more Gents baseball. Thank you, Gent fans, and go Gents.